take a look at that drop. Now, what is causing treasury traders to just sell off at this point in time? I'd buy that for a dollar. Oh, geez. Two weeks into July and still no ghost show. I'm this gonna... means two months and a week hey, without a ghost enough. show. You used to be an broadcaster. Uh, now you are Christ. just an You're an asshole. All right. Don't text to speech any racism, please. All right. Jesus Christ. And we got uh, Futumaki Warrior who hooked it up with a super chat and said, I have watched you for years. Good to see you back. Well, thank you very much, man. I appreciate it. And I'm glad that you're chilling here with us. All right. But as I was stating, we're seeing a drop in the dollars because many of the treasury traders actually are selling off, anticipating because of the data that came out this week believe that the Federal Reserve is going to pause interest rates. <laughs> I'd buy that and, for uh, I, I wouldn't count on it. I, I sincerely wouldn't count on it, all right? But let's go ahead. We got a buy me a coffee by ZZZ. Uh, Mr. Ghost, let me cream fill your... All right, dude, that's enough. And by the way, we did have another West Coast capitalist uh, donation. He said, here's an addition from yesterday's donation. Listen, you unappreciated... Oh, I'd buy that for a dollar. Oh, look who it is. It's Menno Ray. Yeah, yeah, I got your racism right here. I'm a melting pot of friendship, and everybody out there goddamn knows it. Anyway, listen, you unappreciated man-children of the American over-entitled piece, pieces of roadside trash. If you are... If you keep encouraging ghosts among the serious listeners and viewers to drink copious amounts of alcohol, they will be getting the fuck out of here, and you can blame all yourselves for no radio graffiti, along with being the latest examples of why Americans are planning to abolish the entitlements that are being paid by the Democrats. Among many left, or excuse me, among any leftists who don't care about history, culture, and the preservation of the United States Constitution. Cheers to everyone who are who really appreciate, uh, who are who. Really appreciate True Capitalist Radio Show and have a great baller Friday. Hashtag money speaks louder than words. P.S. 2000 Honda Civic sucks. Rich cars and classic cars are for real capitalists. Well, there you go, man. <laughs> I'd there buy you that go. For a and whoever the hell this ZZZ is, what the hell is this? Last night I dreamed of us getting each other sloppy blood. All right, that's enough. Anyway, look, uh, epic dollar drop since. Frank and Yen surging as traders weigh Fed path. And as I was stating, the Treasury uh, traders, the Treasury investment community, obviously based on this sell off. And I'm going to talk about that in a minute, Skunkler. All right. We got attacked Norway. Horrible name. Ghost, are you a secret socialist? Hell no. Hell no. All right. <laughs> and we got Ghost Omajima. Ghost Omajima with a basic membership. Cheers to Ghost Omajima. And then he hooked it up with a super chat. Hashtag investigate 42 coin. Yeah, I'd buy yeah, that right. for a dollar. Yeah, right, you asshole. All right. Hey, hold on. We got some more super chats. That, or excuse me, uh, buy me a coffee that we have to do. Ouija Slayer. This is Ron DeSantis' estate. I've also been seeing quite a few Florida license plates on the roads here in Texas lately. Could stuff like this be driving Floridians here? And before I take a look at what uh, Ouija Slayer is suggesting, uh, ZZZ is talking about putting, you know, secretions in a jar or something like that. I have no idea. But let's take a look at what uh, Ouija Slayer is talking about here and uh, see what... Uh, oh, hold on. Put the PC shot on. Uh, Florida baby dies after teen mom adds fentanyl to the bottle thinking it was cocaine. Jesus Christ. I mean, I almost thought that was, uh, you know, Hunter Biden's baby mama there for a second. But no, I'll be honest with you, Ouija Slayer. This is typical of Florida. I mean, even though uh, Ron DeSantis, give him all the credit that you want for fixing Florida. Florida is geographically and literally the human colon of America. All right. No offense to anybody who's in Florida. I know there's some nice beaches out there. Uh, but let's be honest. I mean, Floridian people are, you know, they're off. All right. They're off. It's probably all the hot weather and humidity. I have no idea. But, you know, something is afoot over there in Florida. Uh, but thank you, Ouija Slayer. Cheers to you, and I uh, hope you continue to listen. Uh, but as I was stating, all right, the dollar is taking a massive drop, and it's because Treasury traders believe that the Fed is not going to raise rates this month. They actually believe that there's going to be a pivot. <laughs> And I'd I think this is this is terribly irresponsible of traders, if you want my opinion. 
All right, we got, uh, who the hell? Oh, yeah, we got ZZZ. Look, ZZZ, whoever the hell you are, I'm not going to read these disgusting, filthy, uh, disgusting fucking texts that you're doing here, all right? Jesus Christ. And we got uh, cooking and investing lover with a super chat. Anyone can make money. Holding it is harder. Honda and Acura products let you do that. Reliable products are... Uh, man, you're, you're falling for that stupid meme too, cooking and investing lover. Jesus Christ. And to think I had some respect for you, for heaven's sake. Anyway, once again, the dollar not doing too well, but I think that may be temporary. And I think that the investors are going to be a little surprised that, um, you know, what, what they're in for. I, I, I absolutely do not believe that... <laughs> oh, I'd geez. buy that for a dollar. The ghost show is a lot like Ghost himself in bed, as it only comes once a month. You son of a bitch. All right, you son of a bitch. All right, let's not start this Baller Friday like this, please, all right? Let's not start this Fuck Baller Texas. Friday. Unpatriotic fucks. Oh, yeah, Menno Ray, come on down here to Texas and say that and see if your ass don't get beat into dog meat, boy. Do you understand what I'm saying? Anyway, as the dollar is kind of pulling back because Treasury, sec uh, Treasury traders excuse me, are thinking that the Fed's going to pause, Alex Mashinsky... All right. Charged with crypto fraud. Charged with crypto Anyone fraud. Anyone else not give a fuck about this? I saw Adam 22 wife get plowed. Great. She looked like a whole nother woman taking that BBC in her. Great, Meno Ray. Now we know exactly where you're coming from. You're an immature, pornographic, addicted piece of, of disgruntled, despicable, probably slovenly trash. All right. So why don't you just sit there and continue to cuck over some other buddy else's long schlong. All right. Anyway, as I was stating before I got rudely interrupted by this uh, piece of mental disposable piece of road trash, I'm talking about Menno Ray, Excelsior CEO Alex Mashinsky charged with crypto fraud. Now, I want to bring you all down to reality. I'm talking you crypto tards out there that think that by, I don't know, this ruling that happened in favor of XRP, that somehow this is going to translate to cryptocurrency going through the roof. Let me explain something to you, first and foremost. Take a look at Bloomberg. Did Ripple win or lose in court today? Yes. Now, did any of you geniuses read the fucking ruling? Of course not. You want to know why? Because you're idiots, all right? You are man children and are idiots. All right? You're fucking morons. What it said in the goddamn ruling is that what makes Ripple legal is the transfer of Ripple between fucking financial institutions, not people, you fucking stupid dumbasses. Do you know that? I bet you didn't know that, did you? You fucking moron. Why do you think fucking goddamn crypto went down today? Crypto went down today because some fucking idiot decided to read what the fuck was in the goddamn ruling. So, you morons that are out here saying, yay, look, a fucking ripple ruling, yay, crypto to the moon, you people <laughs> are idiots. You're idiots. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> West Coast <laughs> capitalist is lover. Are you fucking, that was Mickey Mouse. Jesus, God, that's enough, all right? Jesus Christ. Anyway, as I was stating before I got rudely interrupted by some fucking idiot West Coast capitalist lover Mickey Mouse, whatever the fucking shit is, let me tell you something right now, okay? You people that celebrated yesterday by buying into fucking cryptocurrency because of this ruling, it just proves to you that you people are stupid, and, you you know, in the next five years, when you're fucking living in a capsule and eating deep-fried crickets, I want you to think of me, all right? I want you to think of me because you people are fucking unabated, unadulterated fucking morons. All right? This means, first of all, let me tell you what this Ripple ruling means. First and foremost, it means that, yeah, uh, Ripple can be traded amongst financial institutions and banks. Do you understand? It is probably going to be... Oh, I'd Jesus. buy that for a dollar. Ah, here we go. Jesus Christ. Uh, yeah, I mean, it, ear rape much? Ear rape much? Jesus Christ. Hey, is that me? Hey, that's me! 
fuck that fucking Alamo and fuck your Longhorn Pier. Up there by Dallas Cowboy, they have a draw breath. And fuck you, come, then. All right. Thank you I very much. I fingers to the pole, then I thought I wrote some pretty good songs to it. the wrath of the Texas Elves. I mean, come on, man. All right? Fucking AI. You know? Fucking AI. Anyway, we got a super chat from Colonel Transisco from Steel Brigade. Hashtag True Fraud Radio. Moo. Sound like your granny made, uh, what? Sounds like your, what? What the fuck are you doing? You're making fun of my granny? Colonel Transisco, what the fuck's your problem? And, uh, oh, jeez. buy that for a dollar. Mrs. Ghost, oh, you took the God. dick incredibly and perfect. Dude, Did you love the cream donate. pies the most? Listen. It sure was extremely messy. You're a messy. sick bastard. Don't donate text-to-speech if all you're going to do is say something disgustingly perverted or racist. We don't need that shit. Anyway, Lee Apoc Kirkus said, uh, you're mad because you lost a bunch on crypto. Keep seething, Ghost. Dude, I've made... <laughs> I, 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 your feelings will get hurt how much I made in cryptocurrency, son. What are you talking about? I bought Ethereum when it was fucking 20-something dollars, okay? I sold off when it was at four grand, okay? I bought into fucking Bitcoin when it was at 800 bucks. I sold off at $65,000. I'd buy that for a dollar. All right, so don't fucking go Why there. Why continue to twist yourself into a pretzel, ghost? You were wrong about crypto. Get over yourself. Ripple won. You lost. All right. Well, it, dude, believe what you want. But I'm telling you what it is. And it is, is that Ripple is not a cryptocurrency. It's a centralized private ledger. Okay? It goes against the idea of why crypto was created to begin with. And, of course, many of you people are fucking slow-brained. You got fucking a relaxed brain. You know, you got, you got very so, slow process of being able to comprehend things that you can't comprehend this in your obsessive brain. Okay? So congratulations to all you crypto tards out there. You've rolled out the red carpet so that the central banks will be the proprietors of any digital currency. Congratulations, you idiots. Congratulations, all right? Okay, okay. Okay. Would you still love your daughter if she turned out to be my sister-in-law? She's still your daughter, but I get your money when you die. Uh, Froppy, uh, I would get her tested for HIV AIDS if she even touched you, all right? Anyway, Frank Zappa, it can still be regulated as a value substituting as a currency. That's how uh, they got Bitcoin unregulated in BTC exchanges in Silk Road. I'm, I'm look I'm not saying that there is not money to be made it's just not worth the time for me at this point anymore anyway we got Hasso with the masturbating hippo emoji <laughs> I'd buy that for a dollar I'm not fucking your daughter I'm fucking her brother oh, I mean great. her husband I mean her son I mean yeah no wait hold on why is your family tree a fucking circle? Yeah, uh, yeah. Notice how you know you're talking about. Uh, never mind, Froppy. All right, take about ten steps away from my freaking butt crack. All right. Seriously, I know that you're a homosexual, but the sign on my ass says "Do not enter." Okay. I know you're the kind of individual that. Oh, <laughs> Jesus I'd Christ! Buy that for a dollar. What? Uh, congratulations to PewDiePie and his wife. Who gives Marcia, a shit? On the birth of their first child. Who Bjorn. gives a fuck? PewDiePie represents the greatest of the young generation and shows that you can be a gamer, a weeb, a capitalist, and a family. He's man. a fucking idiot. What are you talking about? He's a I'd fucking moron. Ghost's testicles taste like Budweiser mixed with Wendy's Baconator and mango ice cream. Ah, oh, Jesus. Can y'all just stop, please, all right? Y'all are fucking ruining my baller Friday as it is. And look, I'm losing listeners because of your filthiness on the text-to-speech and shit. I'm losing listeners. And it ain't just there. It's also here, too. Look at this. Look at these idiots. Look at this. Look at this. Look at this. Who look at the Dietrich loves tea? What the fuck is that? What the fuck is this crap? Can you please shut the fuck up? Everyone thinks you're yelling makes you sound freaking retarded. Well, well, you know what? Fuck you! How about that? And Punish Fox, though, you can afford hair plugs, but you can't buy me a tooth? Man, I don't I don't need hair plugs, all right? I, I have all my hair. I'm not some balding piece of trash. And no offense to any of you bald guys. I know it hurts. You know, you, 
you know, you're frolically challenged and whatnot. You know, there's birds pecking at your head and shit. You get fucking sunburn on the top of your head. Look, I'm sorry. I don't have that problem. All right. I don't have that problem. I got I got a I got a nice beautiful fro. All right. So I don't know what the hell you're talking about. Hair plugs. Jesus Christ. Anyway, let's move on from crypto. Oh yeah, before I move on from crypto, uh all right, they know that I'm gonna tell you in a second. Hold on, we got Misfit who hooked it up with a super chat. My parents innecessarily incently, excuse me, uh complain about missing dishes and they're threatening to kick me out of the house if I don't stop hiding them under my bed. What do I do? Clean your fucking room and, and do the dishes. How about that, you little brat? How about that? How about fucking pick up your goddamn room and clean the fucking dishes for mom and dad? Letting you sleep there for free? You're fucking probably, you probably live in a fucking pigsty, for Christ's sake. And punish Foxo. Okay, I forgot. They call them transplants now. I don't know what the hell you're talking about, man. But let me tell you. Let me show you who qualifies. This is who qualifies, okay? Borrowers are eligible for forgiveness if they accumulated the equivalent of 20 to 25 years of qualifying months. There, <laughs> there it is. There it is right there. Here are the things I have. There it is. All right. Bad girls, that's great. Gang bangs. Incest. Stop donating. I'm just going to donate shit dicks. like this. All right. Get, shut up. All right, Dietrich IP. Look, if you're going to donate anything and you're going to be foul mouth and you're going to be racist, then get the hell out of here right the fuck right now. I'm not even joking around. Anyway, once again, all of you people that think, oh, I'm going to get my college debt paid for. Thank you, Biden. Borrowers are eligible for forgiveness if they have accumulated the equivalent of either 20 to 25 years of qualifying months. So the point I'm trying to make is, folks, is that they put out this thing as if, oh, my God, look, Biden and Harris, they're going to help the college idiots. <laughs> they're going to help them <laughs> when they're not. All right. Uh, shut up. All right, asshole. Shut the fuck up. Jesus Christ. We got Reginald Masters with a uh, poopy emoji. Look, I'm going to end this goddamn Baller Friday show early if y'all continue with this garbage. I'm not fucking kidding around. I'm not kidding around. I bet most of you are college debt-ridden pieces of trash, aren't y'all? I bet most of you trolls are out there with college debt out your ass and no fucking job. No fucking job. But hey, wait about 20 to 25 years, and maybe you'll qualify for one of these programs. <laughs> Oh, my God. This is hilarious. I mean, don't show young people feel a little stupid that the Biden administration thinks that it can get one over on you? Anyway, thank you. I'm not going to say that name. <laughs> I'd buy that. Real ghost dollar. quotes. Israel is our greatest ally. Don't you understand that? I mean, all, all this talk about USS Liberty, it was a fucking accident, okay? Donald Trump is the greatest American president in All American right. history. That's a nice... Do you understand me? Get, get it out of here! Follow Donald Shut Trump! Up! <laughs> Shut up! Shut the fuck up! Shut up! Fuck you. I work hard for my money, and I don't even have any fucking debt. These poor fucks need to work instead of being... All right, well, I disagree with that last racist part of your fucking comment, but I do agree with you that these people need to go back to work. All right? And all of you people that are waiting for your college debt to be paid, you need to just shut your stupid mouths, get lift your fucking bootstraps up, and go get yourself a fucking job. And if you don't have a job, then you're a fucking waste of life, all right? If you're somebody that's dependent on mommy or daddy or granny or auntie or anybody, and you don't fucking pay your own way, you're a piece of trash. You are a piece of shit, all right? You are a, a four-flushing, half-pint piece of enema bag cleaning, foreskin muzzle-loving, cauliflower cock-sucking, bloody shitty underwear collecting, pubic hair inspecting pieces of turkey tit sucking, uh, seat sniffing pieces of trash. That's what the fuck you are, all right? That's what the fuck I'd you are. That for a and what is it, Derek? No. Yeah, no. How about you know on these nuts? How about that shit? Probably owe college debt for Christ's sake. All right, get back to work. All right? Get back to work, all of you. And speaking of Biden, you know, as senile as he is and, you know, has 
uh, gaff-ridden that he is and all the mistakes he's made in his presidency here, take a look at how much he's raising in fundraising for his re-election. Take a look at this. That even though you've got all the fringe Republicans backing up Trump... <laughs> I'd buy oh, that for Jesus a Christ. You can't say shit about working when you get your retard fans to donate you shit and you sit on your fat red neck ass doing absolutely nothing. Hey, whoa, 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 wait a minute, Anonymous. <laughs> well, hold on I'd just a second there. A hold on just a second. Vartish, 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 uh, Vartish, 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 Shut up! Hey, look at Ghost Omajima. It's crazy how people throw money at old people. Yeah, real funny, asshole, all right? Now, let me tell you something right now. I'm a business owner. Do you understand that? I'm a respected member of my community here. I mean, what are you people besides a bunch of shit fucking posters on the Internet and a bunch of troll terrorists, for Christ's sake? And by the way, you know, you troll terrorists better watch your asses. You know what I'm saying? Did y'all hear about this? <laughs> Hold on. Oh, jeez. What now? I use taxpayers' money to watch cherrypimps.com and ask porn girls. If they can say my name for me to come. Oh, Thank Jesus you, Ghost. Christ. <sighs> All right, never mind, dude. I, I'm just, I mean, I, I'm over here trying, man. I'm trying, but uh, I, I don't know, man. Ne never mind. Can, can I just get back to my show, please? All right. Anyway, once again, Biden raised $72 million in the second quarter, doubling Trump's intake. Unbelievable. And it shows you, folks, that as much as Trump is leading in the GOP polls, he obviously doesn't lead in America. He's going to lose the election. And why these fucking fringe, cringe Republicans continue to back this guy up? I have no idea. Shut up, Froppy, all right? Anyway, as I was stating, folks, okay, uh, we need to pick a winner. All right, for the GOP. And look, not to get off Biden here, because there's a lot of Biden news here, okay? <laughs> oh, Jesus Christ! All U.S. better keep pumping my XRP. Me and Elaine need it to buy up Epstein's Island from up under the bank. We gonna use it to start the crazy capitalist club. Oh, we gonna my change God. all the C's to K's to show how crazy we are. All right, everybody just calm down, all right? You guys are now making my show turn into a circus sh side show at this point in time. Enough of the text to speeches, please! Now, in other Biden news, y'all remember that cocaine was found in the White House. Well, folks, if this doesn't show you that the government protects the president, then I don't know what the fuck does, all right? Secret Service closes the White House cocaine investigation. Oh, I hate and want to Can you shut the fuck game. up? Stop Nothing fucking the speech and you stupid fucks! Stop! Jesus Christ! You fuckers are ruining my baller Friday! Shut the fuck up! Jesus Christ! And what is this punish Foxo? If a bug asked you to spit on it, would you do it? I'm sure you spit on a lot of things that have bugs on it, you fucking diseased fucking hole. Anyway, as I was stating, before I got rudely interrupted by these fucking stupid troll terrorists, and let me tell you something, you idiots in the fucking chat room, y'all better shut the fuck up right now. Y'all better shut the fuck up right now. Imagine actually wage cucking Lamau. I'll be sitting at home enjoying myself eating chicken tendies bought with taxpayer money. I don't think that you're eating chicken tendies, dude. Chicken ten uh, by the way, real chicken is a little bit, it's a little pricey. All right, and I, I know that those EBT cards don't go more than, what, three or 400 a month. And I guarantee you ain't buying real chicken with that price, baby, all right? I mean, you, I guarantee you ain't doing that. I mean, you notice you don't see all these folks that collect EBT. You, you don't see them prancing around saying, yeah, it's stamp day, baby. I'm over here getting steaks and shit. You can't afford steaks. You can't, you can't afford steaks in EBT. I mean, four or five steaks will take your whole EBT at this point in time. All right, a uh, fucking 10-piece uh, chicken breast of real chicken will probably take most of your goddamn EBT. So I know you ain't doing that, all right? That may have worked during the Obama administration. That don't work here anymore, buddy. All right? I'd buy that for That don't dollar. work anymore. Will you service my schmeckle? Dude, shut up, for Christ's sake. Anyway, we got... Ah, oh, Jesus. This is not the real Al Chappers, dude. 
<laughs> uh, this is not the I real Al Chappers. My girlfriend's father called me a pedophile just because she's 22 and I'm 36. Dot completely ruined our 10 year anniversary. That's not funny, dude. That, dude, leave you. That's enough of Al Chappers, all right? Why are you still bringing him up? You all donated like 400 bucks for me to ban him. All right, he's banned. Why are you resurrecting him again? Jesus Christ, we got Don Coyote. You ignore my previous super chat like you always do. My name is Lou You ruined your own baller Friday. If you didn't show up, you wouldn't be subjected to these trolls. Oh, fuck Your you. choice if you still want to be tortured. Oh, look at that. They admit they're torturing me. They admit they're torturing me. Kill me. I'm not Shut up. We're not, we're not playing that. We're not playing that, all right? Hey, Marshall Burns, you little bitch saying to ban me. How about type do do far to ban Marshall? I'm going to shove a whole 12-pack on Mountain Steam. Uh, uh, uh oh uh-oh, uh-oh. It, it didn't take long for people to want ban Froppy, believe me, all right? I mean, you know, Froppy, you know, acts like one of these uh, drag queens that you see on uh, fucking RuPaul's drag show and, you know, tries to act like, yes, bitch, it's fucking me. It's Froppy, bitch, all right? Let me show you my anal camel toe, bitch. All right, it's still fucking tighter than your mother's pussy, bitch. Fucking fruit bowl. Anyway, Don, Don Coyote said that I ignored his previous super chat, which I don't remember. Uh, I'm I'm coming for your teeth like Al Chappers is coming for your grandson. Well, maybe you wonder why I ignored it, you stupid furry fruit bowl. And Ghost Omajima, yeah, go ahead and yell at yell at us. That'll be good for that scuffed voice that you had yesterday. Literally zero integrity. <laughs> yeah, I've got your integrity time. right here, Ghosto. Blast the S hard. They deserve it. Yeah, a hey, moon man. By the way, uh, I, I have that fucking word, that derogatory racist word, banned. All right, I don't know how some people get around it, but I got it banned. You racist piece of trash. And trolling the interwebs, we love Ghost and he loves us. Well, I don't know about that. I mean, I'll stick my hand in friendship, of course, with a rubber glove on it, you know, but I'll I'll stick my hand out to you in friendship with a rubber glove on it, you know, because I don't know what the hell you people have. I mean, you know, y'all have all kinds of social diseases, for Christ's sake. I mean, you know, I shake your hand, and before you know it, black sores all over it, you know what I mean? Anyway, as I was stating, the Secret Service closes the White House cocaine investigation and says that... Oh, uh, I'd she, buy that Andrew right Johnson! Now. And by the way, Andrew Johnson, you didn't pay enough for the text-to-speech, all right? All right, you paid shitty euros, which are down on the dollar, which, by the way, the dollar is tanking right now. That goes to show you that your little euro cuck fucking currency ain't worth the shit. All right, so the next time you want to do a text-to-speech, make sure to pay for it. Make sure to pay for it. Oh, Jesus Christ. Here we go with this crap. Here we go with this crap. Shut up! Jesus Christ! And what the hell is that supposed to mean? What the hell is that supposed to mean? All right, shut up, Anonymous, all right? And trolling the interweb said, no glove, no love. What is that? Is that like something of a condom reference? I have never heard that one. I've never heard that one. The real CC. Please let me suck your dick ghost. I'll make you come while we both watch Melon and then you can pump my ass like the fruity ass I am. Hey, whoa! How were you able to say that? Disgusting creatures. Get out of my sight. All right, dude, look. Take this off. All right, look. I'm going to warn you guys one last time, all right? You guys are ruining my fucking baller Friday, and if you all don't cut the crap, we're going to be, you know, we're going to have a problem. All right? Do you all understand me? If y'all don't cut the crap, we're going to have a serious problem. Now, as I was stating before I got bombarded by a bunch of troll terrorist, racist, fucking cyber vermin fruity asses, the Secret Service has closed the White House cocaine investigation, says it's not able to identify the suspect. According to reports, the Secret Service couldn't find any fingerprints on the mechanism carrying the cocaine. What a shock of the booger sugar dance. I don't know if y'all saw that. I'd buy that the booger dollar. sugar dance. A A A A E W W W W W W W W W W W W Shut the hell up with the damn W's, man! 
Jesus Christ. I'm telling you, all of you people that are like, hey, I want to be a streamer. You're going to have to put up with this garbage. Do you think that you could put up with this? Huh? Do you think you could put up with this? And what is this? Punish Fox? So be honest. Do you believe the gravel theory? We're all... Oh. I'd buy that for a dollar. What do you call a ghost? Talking about political news and crypto. A f uh, dude, that's it. I'm fucking done, dude. I, I don't need to fucking put up with this shit on a fucking baller Friday, man. I don't need to put up with this crap. Anyway, gravel theory is fake. Uh, it produces by popping beach sand in, in a can with oil. Also, what about the two? Dude, who gives a shit about what the hell you just posted there, El Foxo? Look, I'm not fucking joking around, man. I mean, I've only, I haven't even been on here for an hour. I haven't even been on here for an hour. Lover, don't deny it, Ghostler Jones. I haven't even been on here for an hour, and this is the kind of crap I'm getting on a goddamn Baller Friday, man. Unbelievable. Unfucking believable. <laughs> I'd buy that for a dollar. And what do you want, Kurt Johnson? No, 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 I'm not letting you fucking say that racist shit, Kurt Johnson, all right? You should know better than that, all right? I'm not letting it. I, fuck you, Kurt Johnson. Anyway, oh, Jesus Christ, man. Come on! And what is this? Put the PC shot on. Capitalist said, uh,. Oh, God. I'd buy that for a dollar. Speaking of the trolls donating like $400, that should not have even happened. Al Chappers should not have been banned. He is a serious listener and a true capitalist and member of the channel. Everyone, including you, Ghost, show him some respect. Uh, I, look, I, I tried to show him respect. Uh, the chat doesn't want him. They, they, they got together. They, they raised $400 to kick him out, dude. What can I do? All right, I mean, it, 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 I got to do what I can do. And Ghost Omajima is 42 coin, 420 friendly. I don't fucking know, you idiot. Anyway, as I was stating, capitalists, money talks, but talk is cheap. Actions speak louder than words. Cheers to all the capitalists, and happy Baller Friday. Well, happy Baller Friday to that capitalist right there, man. That's definitely what we need. We need some more positivity. As a matter of fact, where's my positive reinforcement button? You're goddamn right. I can do it. You're goddamn right. Let's 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 hear one more positive reinforcement. Do what you love. I'm I'm trying to do what I love. I'm trying. And uh, Zenith Video says, "When are you going to start an only cans and only cans?" <laughs> I'd buy that. Oh for Jesus! A look look at this. Look at this. Go. Leave. Look at this. Get my fans. Get by here. the way. Go. My fans. Leave. Get. Get out of here. Go. You leave. get the fuck out of here. Get out of you here. You get out! Go. Leave. Get. Get out of here. Go. Shut Leave. the fuck up. Get, get. And Shut up! You get the fuck out of here! I'm trying to do a show! You get the hell out of here! Anyway, let me get back to my show, folks, okay? I'm sorry. I know that there's people on the Baller Friday that want to hear the financial insight and the political and social commentary of True Capitalist Radio, and unfortunately, we're being bombarded by a bunch of troll terrorists, and I don't appreciate it one bit. Now, aside from Biden, what the hell are the Democrats doing? Well, folks, this should show you that the Democrats, as I've been stating on many shows, the Democrats are now moving away from the fringe subjects and policies that they were harping on for the past six or seven years, and let me show you. Take a look at this. Nine House Democrats voted to block, quote, race-based theories from being taught in military-run schools. Now, this is a clear indicator that political tides are turning and that the Democrats can no longer be blindly supporting... Ah, oh, Jesus Christ. You can do the ghost show. Uh, what, uh, why? Why? You fucking people won't even let me do my serious true capitalist radio show. Why the fuck would I want to do a ghost show at this point in time? Jesus Christ. Somebody named Ghost Chan. Happy Baller Friday. That's great. Ghost Chan. That's what I need. Anyway, as I was stating, nine House Democrats voted to block race-based theories from being taught in military schools. That for a dollar. What is it, Moon Man? I like sugar, and I like tea, but I don't like... 
No, sir. All right, all right. We don't care. All right, we don't care, Moon Man. We don't care. Anyway, look, the tides are turning politically. All right, the Democrats know that America doesn't want, uh, you know, these fringe based policies that they've been harping on for the past five or six years. Now you're seeing the political tides turn. They're making themselves look like idiots. And secondly, take a. Oh, Jesus. I'd buy that for a dollar. Ghost, you are strong enough to show those troll terrorists who is the real alpha male of political and social commentary. Don't quit, because they troll you with TTS. LOL, just kidding, you're a Shit, alright dude, I've, I've had about enough, enough of this crap! Alright, if you don't have anything positive to say on fucking text-to-speech, then don't send me a fucking text-to-speech! Do you understand me, alright? I don't want to hear anything racist, I don't want to hear anything perverted, I'm tired of this shit! Alright, this is your fucking last warning! All of you! All of you! Now, anyway, as I was stating, all right? And hold on, Mike said, switch to Pig Vaughn to YouTube for Ghost Show. Pig Vaughn? Dude, that's, that's rude. All right, that is absolutely rude. Anyway, as I was stating before I got rudely interrupted by these fucking troll terrorists, nine House Democrats voted to block race-based theories from being taught in military-run schools. Now, while House Democrats are doing things like that, what the hell are the Republicans doing? Take a look at what the Republicans are doing. Right in a fucking election cycle, you got some stupid fucking asshole from, where the fuck is this idiot from? I, for, I forgot where he's from. Fucking Colorado. Where, where, the, where the fuck this moron's from? But listen to what this idiot says. I'd buy that for a dollar. Oh, Jesus. Crying mall bitchler since you like my money so much. Be strong and take it, poor man. You, stu you fucking son of a bitch. You son of a bitch. Mick, love in uh, 2169. The only cans I want to see are engineer sign cans. Also, hey, Ghost, can the engineer say hi to us, please? He's working them wires, but please let him. Hey, engineer, can you say something to the people out here, please? <laughs> he says hi, all right? And we got Mike. Stop IP grabbing, Ghost. It's illegal. I'm not fucking grabbing anybody's IP, dude. Shut the fuck up. Now, like I said, while the Democrats are, you know, kind of turning the tide politically, what are we doing as Republicans? Take a look at this Arizona asshole. Race-based theory being taught in military schools. And then you've got this dollar. idiot. Something positive. Your recent HIV slash oh, AIDS status after putting your number one inside WCC's number two. All right, shut up. All right, shut the fuck up. Listen to this idiot. All right, this is during an election cycle. This certainly doesn't make the GOP look any favorable. Unbelievably inspiring. How is this guy representing anyone in the Congress? <laughs> I'd buy that. And what is dollar. it? Republicans are really embarrassing us. People like Eli Crane are making Democrats good in comparison and closer to winning the next election. And also, you're a. Gee, dude, I, I gotta. Look, I'll be honest with you. If y'all don't stop this shit, I'm going to get the hell out of here right the fuck right now, all right? I don't need to be taking this shit, especially on a bar Friday, all right? I could be at a bar right now hooking it up with happy hour and some fucking hot chicken wings that is being served to me by some bimbo with her tits and ass hanging out than to sit here and put up with a bunch of neck-bearded, red-headed, four-eyed, freckled, spent stepchildren like you fucking people! Oh, Jesus. I'd buy that for a dollar. Oh, God. I have two number nines. A number nine large, a number six with extra dip. Two number 49s, one with cheese, a no, large. No, no, no. Oh, All right, dude. I've had enough. All right. I've, I've had enough. And then we wonder why idiots like this are elected into Congress. I mean, just take a look at the people. All right. I mean, you know what? I think George Carlin said this one time. You know what could. Is a great campaign slogan that can be honest with the American people. The public sucks. All right. How's that for a campaign slogan? The public sucks. All right. And you want to know why the public sucks? Take a look at what's representing us in Washington, D.C. right now. Take a look at what's what's fucking representing us in fucking Washington. 
The public sucks, all right? Jesus Christ. As a matter of fact, where's my pipe? Where's my pipe? I'm sorry, folks. I got I to gotta smoke here, all right? I'm sorry. I, I hate to do this. I know that I take time in the show to do this. I'm sorry, but I, I have to. I absolutely have to, man. I mean, we're we're uh, the American public are looking like a bunch of idiots. You know that? And they're shameless. And that's the biggest flaw in the American culture right now is a lack of shame. A lack of shame. And because of that lack of shame, that's why these people don't care if you make fun of them because they're getting neat bucks and living off mommy and daddy's couch. They don't care. They don't care that, you know, you're calling them out for watching pedophilia cartoons like anime. They don't care that you're calling them out being man children because they're going to cosplay at fucking cons and shit. <sighs> Unbelievable, man. I'm telling you. This is why we need legal immigrants. Yeah, that's why we need immigration reform. To bring in people based on merit and people that love this country that are going to substitute the kind of trash that is basically running rampant in America today. I'm sorry. I have to say, I'm sorry, dude. I mean, it makes me sick whenever I see ungrateful American people that have every fucking opportunity at the palm of their hands, and yet they will piss and moan about how life is hard. They will piss and moan about how they have no opportunities and all this other bullshit only because they can't run a Fortune 500 company right after they get out of college. All right? It's fucking disgusting, man. And trolling the interwebs, majority rules doesn't work in mental hospitals. All right, well, thank you very much there, uh, trolling the interwebs. And we got Mike, Matt Damon is intelligence. Do you watch hentai? What the fuck is that supposed to mean? And Punish Foxo says, you can afford genuine Cialis, but not a tooth. I don't need Cialis. All right, Punish Foxo. All right. All right, uh, you know, my 15 and a half inch John Holmes sausage, you know, you know can uh, perform on command. All right. I'm not like you, who's probably all hopped up on fucking Travada or Discovy or whatever those fucking prep drugs are, and for whatever reason, you don't have any lead in your pencil. As much as Eli Crane is terrible, he is still nothing in comparison to the next Democratic candidate in the state of Washington. Bur oh, great. Yeah, thanks. Walls fall out. Really, really funny. And we got Santa who said, hey, Stoneler, are you going to do radio graffiti for Baller Friday? Are you fucking nuts, Santa? Are you listening to this fucked up fucking shitbird show right now? Are you looking at these fucking trolls? These fucking trolls don't deserve dick as far as I'm concerned, all right? Jesus Christ. And what is it, Brian? Mrs. Dot Ghost gave me such bomb head the other night that I think we need to rename her to Sloppenheimer. Let's vote on it. One in chat for yes, two in chat for no. Sloppenheimer, you fucking asshole. And we got Mike. Uh, Ghost, are you on prep? Thoughts on Fetterman 2024? <laughs> yeah, okay. He, 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 can barely, he can barely do what he's doing now. I mean, have you heard the man talk? It's horrible. He doesn't even know how to spoken, for heaven's sake. All right, let me take a hit of this smoke here, folks. It's tobacco. It's not illegal contraband or anything of that nature. I want to say cheers to all the real fans out there. All the real fans that are listening for the financial insight and the political and social commentary. This one's for you. All right, this one's for all of you. That's it. Got to hold it in, let it hit the brain. All right. And Santa goes, whoa, buddy, I just got here. Well, it's been bad, all right, Santa? It's been fucking bad. So anyway, we talked a little bit about the Democrats and Republicans. Let's talk a little bit about 2024 POTUS. And uh, did y'all hear about this? DeSantis weighs media strategy shift as donors fret about early campaign struggles. Well, folks, we've been talking about that for several shows. Oh, Positive reinforcement message. You can do it. You can beat the... Ghost. Come on. Be a big man with a small dick. Oh, Go ahead. Dude, enough of that shit! Enough of the de derogatory shit, man! I'm tired of this crap! 
Jesus Christ. Mike uh, Mike said, uh, what is this, Fetterman officially in the race? He's on CNN right now. Shut up, asshole, all right? I think I'm fucking that stupid, you dumb Canadian bacon maple leaf up the ass having moose humping piece of trash. Jesus Christ. Oh, here, here's an enemy capitalist, Winston fucked up Fujimori. The least good enemy is better than Western progressive garbage coming out nowadays, Hambone. Western progressive garbage? What are you talking about, man? <laughs> oh. I'd buy that for a dollar. Here's Al Chappers. You know something? That representative from CTC Enterprises is right. No matter how much money some idiots in the chat raise, there was still no reason to ban me. I am a serious capitalist and member of this channel. They seem to be behaving worse. I agree, Al Chappers. They seem to be behaving worse. And I knew this was a bad idea. I knew that these people will... Begr <sighs> I just knew this was going to happen. I just knew it. Anyway, as I was stating, DeSantis weighs his media strategy and donors are fretting about his early campaign struggles. Well, no shit. I mean, the guy has been doing L after L after L. I mean, we've been talking about it for many shows at this point in time. And I knew that his gaffes and his lack of personality while interacting with voters in general, is it was definitely going to affect him. And it is, if you want my personal opinion. And uh, DeSantis, I think, is falling as each day goes by. It's a shame because I thought he had a hell of a lot of political clout going into this election. And then Trump, dare I say, brought him back down to size by releasing that picture of him what looks like uh, crowding around minors. One of them, the minors, what looks like holding a beer. Ever since that came out, uh, you can't run yourself as the anti-pedo candidate you can't run yourself as the anti-groomer candidate when you have pictures like that rolling around who knows how many more of those are there what do you mean a second ban he's already banned for heaven's sake <laughs> I joke of the day what is the difference between al chappers and acne Acne comes on your face after you turn 13 oh jesus fucking christ look I'm going to fucking end this goddamn show. You people are ruining. You're ruining my Bowler Friday. Cut the crap. Cut the crap now. Oh, my God, man. You know what, man? Fucking, this is what you get for trying to do a show on a Bowler fucking Friday, man. This is what you fucking get. This is what you get right fucking here, man. Jesus Christ. I'm trying to keep my composure here. I'm really trying to keep my composure. Anyway, Donald Trump earned millions from speeches and golf and resorts. And that's why I'm telling you, this particular run for the president is one huge grift, in my opinion. Just like everybody who's in the right-wing chattering class and all these social media platforms, they're in it for the grift as well. You know what I'm saying? So, I'm just saying, I'm just saying. All right, and speaking of Trump, there's a lot of Trump news out here as well, so we got to we gotta cover it here on True Capitalist Radio. Did you hear that his son-in-law, Ivanka's husband, Jared Kushner... <laughs> oh, I'd Jesus Christ! Dollar. What? Al Chappers, a rapist and a pedophile, walk into a bar. He sits down and orders a drink. Oh, Jesus Christ. All right, that's enough. Can everybody just stop, please? All right? Anyway, as I was stating, Jared Kushner, the son-in-law of Trump, is now cooperating with Jack Smith. Because uh, the fact that they got Jared Kushner cooperating, <laughs> not good. What's the best thing for Al Chappers about 28-year-olds? There's 20 of them. Oh, my God. Look, enough of the fucking fucked up Al Chappers jokes, please. All right? Enough of this shit, please, man. It's Bowler Friday, for heaven's sake. Oh, my God. Dude, I'm going to have to end this show early. I I'm going to be completely honest with you. I can't keep going like this. I mean, this is disgusting. I mean, look, I'm losing listeners at all these foul-mouthed, disgusting, pedophilic jokes that you fucking people are posting in text-to-speech. I'm not even joking around. I mean, the type of text-to-speeches that we're getting, it's like R. Kelly and Roman Polanski and Woody Allen are having a party and are fucking doing text-to-speeches on my fucking show! 
All right, give me another smoke. I'm sorry, I have to take another smoke, folks, all right? And look at everybody in the chat room. Oh, end it now, end it now. Yeah, end this, all right? End this. <sighs> give me a smoke here. All right. I'm sorry, folks. I'm sorry. By the way, y'all hear my Shaq chair, dude? I fucking Shaquille O'Neal. I want my money back. This chair's a piece of shit. This chair's a piece of shit. Listen to this shit. Oh, wait a minute. What, now it's not going to do it? Now it's not going to do it? Fucking dumb shit. <laughs> I'd buy what? dollar. No. Feed ghost to suck it sandwich. Oh, great. Sit there and eat IT. Ghost. Eat IT. Eat IT? You mean eat it? Eat it! Is that what you meant to say? Look at this. It's not even fucking... I don't know. Did, did I put WD-40 or some shit? Oh, I didn't. I don't know. Maybe it was Consuela that comes in and cleans the office here. You know what I mean? Y'all remember Consuela? You know, she comes in... Ah, uh, Mr. Costa, uh, I got my little mijo here. Can he sit over here? He'll be in the corner eating a taco and I'll be cleaning your office, Mr. Ghost. Yeah, whatever. All right, Consuela, just clean the shit. Anyway, Trump very upset that Jared Kushner is co cooperating with Jack Smith, all right? And Santa goes, hey, Ghost, just wanted to say you do a good show. Well, thank you, Santa. You Look at that. That's positive reinforcement right there. That's positive reinforcement by Santa right there, and I needed that. I'll tell you that right damn now. Cheers to Santa. And Fallen Dunn says, gassing out, rocking in a chair, more fatler. <laughs> I mean, this guy is a fucking part of my goddamn uh, membership as well, and he's calling me fatler, by the way. Can you believe this shit? Uh, anyway, bad emoji. What's up, ghost? Happy Baller Friday. Real quick, I heard you host a serious show. When and where can I catch it? You're listening to it, bad emoji. The unfortunate part about it is you got these fucking trolls. Al Chappers might be blind, but he can somehow still see P. Why does Al what? Chappers like 15-year-old wine? It reminds him of his wife. Why what? does Al Chappers love Team Fortress 2? It turned 16 last year. Oh, man, please stop, man. Please stop. Muslims to go to paradise and get 72 virgins. Al Chappers just go to the local primary school. All right, look, I look, I got rid of Al Chappers, all right, because you guys wanted him out of here. And now you keep summoning him. You keep resurrecting him. Y'all are like in some kind of a fucking witchcraft seance of fucked up fucking shitbag pedophile jokes, and you're going to resurrect him from the dead. Cut it out! Hey, what's up, driving, working, or at a bar? Cheers, baby, cheers! Cheers. Cheers to you, man. That was definitely some positive reinforcement there. Driving, working, or at the bar. Cheers to you, man. All right? Gives me a little bit of motivation to continue going while being bombarded by a bunch of fucking imbeciles. I'll tell you that. And we got cooking and investing lover. Put some Teflon gun oil or a three-in-one oil on the chair. Well, don't worry about it. All right, cooking and investing lover. This is a piece of shit. And I want Shaquille O'Neal to give me my money back, all right? I figured that, hey, if it can hold a disgusting fat body like goddamn Shaquille O'Neal up, that this chair should be a fucking decent one, right? It's a piece of crap. All right, it's a piece of crap. Now, let me get back to what I was talking about out here. I was talking about how Trump is very upset with Jared Kushner for cooperating with the special prosecutor. Got to fix the old lady's IRA RMDs today. Cheers. Well, cheers to you, Cal, and I'm glad that you're no longer having bronchitis. <laughs> I cheers to you, man. And what is it, Fruitcake Texan? Happy Fruitcake Friday. Hope you're having a fruit a day mind fewer. It looks like everyone has the jokes handled today, so I'll just use my dono to ask you to pick up 512 when you do radio graffiti uh, later uh, today. You, you think I'm doing radio graffiti? Are you serious? Are you serious? <laughs> <laughs> what the hell? Started the Wagner Rebellion. Ghost did. I did. Hey! Hey! Get that shit! We got a racist fucking Yoda? I mean, what the fuck? Jesus Christ. And we got Jag the Lux Ray who said, Hey, Ghost, sorry I couldn't chat earlier. I was mowing my lawn, plus I'm still a bit ill. 
Uh, hope you're doing good. Stay strong and happy Baller Friday. Well, hey, Jag Deluxe Ray, I'm glad that you worry about l your lawn. Believe it or not, many people in America today just let their shit grow like it's a patch of goddamn pubic hair on their <laughs> private parts. I'd buy that you know what I'm saying? <laughs> hey, hold on just a second. We just got another, uh, we got another buy me a coffee here. Put the PC shot on. We got driving while pooping. Thanks for doing a great show, Ghostler. This is an amazing show. Thanks to all the awesome text to speeches. Shout outs to y'all. By the way, Ghost, the only time you get a piece of tail is when you put your finger tips through your toilet paper. This, uh, Jesus Christ. Yeah, fuck you, whoever the hell you are, all right? I'd fuck buy that you. For a Hey, Ghost Hurry in the Thunderdome. Oh, Something Jesus. Something is dropping and it's serious. Oh, I'm in the middle of a fucking show! All right, dude, look, I'm going to take this detour in the show. I hate to do this, all right? But I'm going to take this detour in the show to see what the hell's going on in the Thunderdome, and you all will be privy to hear it, okay? So let's just let's just go ahead and set it up now, all right? Because I hope that, that there's nothing bad going on in the Thunderdome. That's the last thing we need, all right? That's the last thing we need right now. Is some drama in the Thunderdome. All right, hold on just a second. I'm, I'm sorry, folks, that I have to do this. I'm really sorry. What the hell is this? This better not be fucking... Uh, who the fuck knows what it is? Hold on, hold on. Who is this? We'll see what the hell's going on. All right, what the hell's going on here? Here, I was expecting something cool happening, but there's no one in here. Now they're all coming. Froppy, what the fuck you want? <laughs> Hey, wait, yeah, yeah, hold on, hold on. Yamigo, hold on, Yamigo, why the hell are you saying the N word? You're black, dude. Oh, he laughed. He said it's his word. Hey, well, well, first of all, Froppy, what the, why, do you, why are you disrupting my show for hell? me to come in here? I'm, so <laughs> I'm sorry, I dropped my fucking paper on the floor, man. Shit dropped everywhere. It spilled everywhere. I'm sorry, man. Of course, Froppy shit spilling shit like it's semen. Jesus Christ. Our oh, chapters is donating right now. Seen as going along with the people who managed to get four hundred dollars right. to get me banned, right. or just outright Never taking mind. the piss. Never just mind. Just unban me from the chat uh, and I'm, let I'm, them cope uh, like the idiots they are. Uh, as a matter I of am fact, the true capital. Al Chappers, you know what? They are just a waste of space. Al Chappers, you know what? I'm gonna invite you back into the Thunderdome right now. All right, if you're listening, come back into the Thunderdome right now. All right, and let's talk about this for a second. All right, now. By the way, um, anybody who disrupts, anybody who does this shit What is shit going again, on here? Excuse me. Yo, we need hey, shut the fuck up. All right? Anybody who disrupts this shit, I'm kicking them out of the fucking Thunderdome forever. All right? So don't play your fucking Menards. Don't play anything or I'm kicking you out of the fucking Thunderdome. I'm not fucking kidding around. I am not kidding. Jesus uh -huh. fucking Christ. Who the hell said that? You're getting kicked the fuck out. Who the hell said that? Was that Metal Ray? You're out of here. Get him the fuck out of here. Get him out of here. I'm not fucking kidding around. I'm getting fucking Metal Ray the fuck out of here. Get him out of here. All right, kick him out. Fucking piece of shit. All right. Now, we got Al Chappers invited. All right, he's, he's invited to the chat. I want to get to the bottom of this. All right, I want to get to the bottom of this. So we're waiting for him to come back in. This is a serious issue. Now, by the way, Froppy, I think I'm going to kick you out because you fucking disrupted my show and there's nothing going on here. <laughs> I I'm apologize. Not even a joke. I was trying to be funny. How I'm sorry. Yeah. to make those cheeks clap ghost? Uh, you, you know what? I'm, I'm kicking you out for fucking ruining my show. Kick him out. I'm kicking him out of here. No, please. Come on. Now, get him me out back. of here. I love you. Uh, dude, why are you fucking disrupting my show, you fucking AIDS-infected stupid piece of fucking ass-riding shit? Why in the fuck are you fucking disrupting my show? How is it any different than when anyone else interrupts the show? Nobody disrupts my show, you stupid fucking homosexual. Look, I know you're a homosexual. You're, you're, I know that you think, yeah, bitch, I'm making a fucking, an, uh, I'm making myself known, bitch. I'm fucking special, bitch. Hey, fucking girls, go to the Thunderdome, bitch. There's a lot of things going on, bitch. Well, did you see the chat? I dropped the papers everywhere, man. It's shit just spilled out. I'm sorry. Going on the Thunderdome. Yeah, there's Pop. nothing going on in the Thunderdome, for Christ's sake. All right, now look, Santa, well, where's my where's my Thunderdome invite? Uh, well, I thought I invited you. Oh, Jesus. All right. Echo. All right, dude, yeah, what, what, what great way to advertise the Thunderdome by being a bunch of fucking tards, dude.
Well, 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 hold on one second, because because now Al Trappers, Al Trappers is going to Al Trappers is going to join in here, and then something will actually be happening. So hey, I, technically I didn't lie after all. I'm, I'm kicking your ass out of here anyway, dude. You're an idiot, dude. <laughs> uh, Come on, man. Shame I, on you. Everyone loves me though. I'm I'm, I'm friendly to <laughs> everyone. All right, all right, never mind. Don't disrupt my fucking show again, you stupid fucking freak shows. Sorry, folks. I thought something was happening. This is what you get when you get like those kind of people, like Froppy, who is probably his brain is disintegrating from late stage stage AIDS, and you know he thinks he's funny when he's not. Anyway, uh, be awesome. One says Froppy, Fro Froppy getting banned for making TCR interesting. You think that was interesting? Then get the fuck out of here right the fuck right now if you think it's interesting. And we got Hasso who said towards the reband of Al Capper's. Well, he's going to be banned from this chat. He's just going to be back in the Thunderdome. Although I think he may not want to go in the Thunderdome because many people in the Thunderdome kind of don't like him. So anyway, uh, Punish Fox. So I used to well, what I used a arable land I have to grow catnip simply so I can attract all the local cats and scare them off with a megaphone. Got an I got the idea from you. Oh, Jesus Christ! And people are asking, how do you get into the Thunderdome? Well, folks, I'll give you an invite if you go to buymeacoffee.com slash ghostpolitics and just hook it up with 15 beers. Uh, everybody's in there. Uh, you know, every troll that you see on the show is pretty much in there. So, FYI. Uh, now, the inner circle is completely different. The inner circle, we talk about serious subjects. You know, we're, we talk stocks and shit like that. And what is this? Jimmy Powell seems like Fruit Bowl Friday now. Unfortunately, it does, dude. It really does. Anyway, let me get back to the show, folks. I'm sorry we got sidetracked there. The last thing we were talking about is that Jared Kushner is cooperating with Jack Smith, the special prosecutor for the DOJ, against Trump in apparently the fundraising of January 6th funds, amongst other things. Uh, but I want to talk about Chris Christie, because I am behind Chris Christie because... Uh, <laughs> Jesus fucking Christ. Dollar. What? What? <laughs> Oh, I'd Jesus Christ. Hey, Crater Nipples. Yo mama is so black that when she steps into her car, the oil light goes on. Oh, my God. Please stop it with these fucking sick-ass jokes, please. All right? Please fucking stop it, dude. Oh, my God. And look, someone hooked it up with a buy me a coffee. Uh, howdy, my lazy little ham bone. I'm planning a new way to capitalize by giving your viewers with an AI ghost show. Yeah, do that. I swear to God, I will fucking take you down so fucking fast and, and sue your ass. And look, I'm not even joking. Look, let me let me show you all what I'm talking about. I got to I got to show you. Uh, I got to show you this. I have to show you this because you trolls think that you're going to be able to get away with all this trolley crap and nothing's going to happen to you that you're going to be untouchable and shit. I got to I got to share this story. This was shared in the inner circle, so I got to go to the inner circle to find it. <laughs> I'd buy that for a dollar. Oh, great. That's great. Here we go w, with this Shut up! Jesus Christ, you fucking people, man. Jesus Christ! Shut the fuck up! I'd buy that for a dollar. Oh my god. How many of these are there? How many of these are there? How many of these are there for Christ's sake? Can you all fucking piss off? Just fucking piss off! God damn it! 
Look at these people in the chat room. I'm fucking losing listeners, you assholes. I'm losing listeners, you stupid son of a bitch. Look at this shit. Look at this shit. Where's my Thunderdome invite, you stupid Hey! What the hell is that about? Oh my god, folks. Look, I'm sorry. I, I'm sorry, folks. I'm losing listeners here. Another W. Another W. If you've sent the invite, it's not come up on my screen. Uh, I don't know what's happening with Matrix. All right, well, I'll, I'll invite you again later there, Al Chappers. I'm sorry, I'm in the middle of a fucking... Oh, Jesus Christ. Can you all please stop it? This is fucked up! This is stupid! This is stupid! Oh, God, shut up! Are you fucking kidding me? Are you've got to be kidding me? You have got to be kidding me. How many of these did you fucking idiots donate? How much of these fucking things did you fucking donate, man? God damn it, man! Shut up! Oh, Sneed, Sneed. Sneed. Oh, now it's Sneed, Sneed. huh? Sneed, Sneed now, is that Sneed. it? Sneed. I got your fucking Sneed, Sneed and Seed, Sneed. you son of a Sneed. bitch! Sneed. 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 Oh, uh, man, Sneed. just, just, can Sneed. you please forward this Sneed. shit, please? Just, just, Sneed. forward this shit! <laughs> Ah, uh, another fucking W? Are you fucking kidding me? Are you kidding me? I'm wasting my ball on Friday. I'm literally What? Ghost rape crappy? The fuck? Oh my god. I can't. I don't know how many more of these fuckers have donated, man. They donated a whole shitload of W's, man. I mean, they're, they're, they, they just keep donating the fucking W's, man. They just keep fucking donating, man. They just keep doing it. I can't. I don't know how many. They just keep fucking doing it, man. W W W I'd buy that for a dollar. Oh my god. W W W W W W Look at Cow, he's out of here. Cow is out of here. He's gonna say something racist. Skip it! Skip it! Oh my oh fuck you, Froppy, alright? Go back to the I'm not going back to nothing. I'm not going down to nothing. You're an asshole. And I'm sorry to Cow out here. Cow's like, I'm out of here. You need to get the Spurgs out of here. Hey, look at this. Look at this. Calm down, ghost. Look at this it's shit. It's only a letter. Look at this crap. God damn it. How many did you all fucking donate, man? How many of these fucking W's did you donate, man? Shut up! Stop! Everybody stop, man. Just stop. Stop donating, man! Just stop! You've gotta be kidding me! You've gotta be fucking kidding me! You've gotta be kidding me! Shut the fuck up! God damn you! God, another one? Another fucking one? Are you kidding me? Another fucking one? I mean, good God! Just stop, please, all right? You're giving me a headache! You're giving me a fucking headache! Stop! You're giving me a headache! Shut up! 
Y'all are gonna have to give me a break, man. Y'all are gonna have to give me a break. Shut up! Christ! Get back into the Thunderdome. West Coast is crying and freaking out, and also type Sig P230 to snipe Menards. All right, that's enough. All right, I'm not going back into the fucking Thunderdome, man. I'm kicking out Froppy. When I get back in there, I'm kicking his ass. Oh no! W Stop! Just stop! Stop the shit! Stop the shit! Stop the shit, man! God damn it! Enough of this bullshit! Just shut the fuck up! How many of these did you fucking idiots donate, man? How many did you idiots donate? Please, that's enough, please, all right? That's enough of this shit! That's enough of this shit! Uh, what is this? Now L. Now L. Now L. I'm sorry, folks. I'm sorry. Shut up! Damn it! Uh, uh, I'm gonna end the show. All right, I'm gonna end the fucking show, dude. I'm not even joking around. I'm gonna end the fucking show. This is ridiculous. This is utterly ridiculous, and I'm sorry. Shut up! I'm sorry, folks. When are we getting radio graffiti? You're not getting no fucking radio graffiti, are you kidding me? You ruined the Baller Friday! You've ruined Baller Friday! And you want radio graffiti? Go fuck yourself! Oh Jesus Christ. Oh, my God. I've had just about enough of this shit. I've had just about enough of this shit. How many did you donate for fuck's sake? How many? How many? How many? Ocean Gate Ghost Hunter. Shut the fuck up! Jesus Christ! Stop! Just everybody stop! Everybody stop now! Stop! I'll stop the bullshit. I'll chill TF out. I'm sorry. Don't ban me. I enjoy talking to everyone in the chat. Yeah, you should. Me to never do that ever again. You should, Froppy. Yeah, no shit, everybody in the Thunderdome is cool, you asshole! Oh, Jesus, not a fucking gen, dude. Please. Oh, and what is it, Haywood? Hey, Ghost. Just tuned in. Been visiting with my uncle in Oklahoma. Drinking some 9% triple beer with my uncle. His time is more valuable than yours as he won't be around as long and I can always watch the replay. Grab a beer, you oh, You son of a bitch, dude. Buy that Not- Jesus, fuck. Stop, man! Come on! Come on! Oh my god. Shut up, alright? I'm fucking done with this show, dude.
All right, I'm reading the final super chats and I'm getting the fuck out of here. This was a ridiculous, fucked up fucking Baller Friday show. I expected a lot more from this show than what you people have shown me. I'll tell you that right goddamn now. And we got Cal. There's a reason you only have 200 viewers versus Nick Ro Roachfort's real estate stream with 3K viewers. You got to lock the Spurgs out. I'm out. I'm sorry, Cal. I know, dude. Believe me, I know. I'm sorry, dude. I, I mean, what can I do, man? I mean, they're fucking like a bad case of herpes, these fucking trolls. They never go away. And Santa, I, I unfortunately didn't get to your fucking text, uh, your super chat, because these fucking trolls spammed the hell out of the goddamn chat room with WWW and shit. And there's Jimmy Powell with a W super chat. Jesus Christ. Oh, I'd God. buy that for a dollar. All right, that's enough. All right, that's enough, please. Dude, that's a Shut the fuck up! And hold on, somebody's basing on my street? Are you fucking... I'm calling the cops. Who's basing on my street? Hold on just a second. I'm calling the fucking cops. I'm not joking around. Who the fuck is basing on my fucking street? Fuck off with the W spam. Who the fuck is... Your ass blasted about getting kicked out to some. Now you're acting out by get spamming the fucking here, show. Or I'm calling the cops! <laughs> Don't I get that, that base bro. shit out of here! Some fucking basing in my goddamn neighborhood! I live in fucking high class America! Alright, shut up, the alphabet people! I live in a fucking goddamn high class America neighborhood, and I've got some and a fucking lowrider jamming out to some fucking goddamn rap music and I can hear it vibrating. That's illegal. I'm going to call the cops. Turn that shit off. Or I'm calling the cops. Turn that shit off. Fucking asshole. Anyway, we got Beyond Basio. If you're uh, going to ban Froppy, we're going to send W's. And uh, Jimmy Powell said, I've lost about 30 listeners. <laughs> wow, I wonder why, Jimmy Powell. And uh, Maury, how much for radio graffiti? <laughs> Are you kidding me? Are you kidding me? There's Urinator. If you could only turn off the donos. Look, the donations are meant for interactivity, okay? Unfortunately, whenever you leave things open to the public, this is why we can't have nice things, all right? And trolling the interwebs, is this a ASMR? No, this is. Uh, all right. There's some nasty chicken grease, corn oil, and cream beef, bitch. All right, how do you like that? And we got feminist socialists keep crying, by the way. Yeah, all right, whatever. How much would you want for 15 minutes of radio graffiti? And look at Al, I'm not saying that name. When is radio graffiti? Stop asking me about fucking radio graffiti! And we've got Night Trem 10 with a game over hippo emoji. All right. All right. Look, uh, I'm going to tell you trolls something. All right. Because you people have been cyber bullying me long enough. And I'm going to tell you all something because I know this applies to each and every one of you out there. I want to tell you something. And this goes out to a warning to all of you. Have y'all heard about this? Destiny 2 player who terrorized Bungie community manager must pay almost $500,000 in punitive damages. Huh? How do you like that? And you know what this person from the de this Destiny 2 player, by the way, who's the guy that's you know harassing the Bungie community guy? His name is Jesse James Coomer. Not even joking. Jesse James Coomer terrorized a prominent Destiny 2 community manager and basically sent him a pizza. And because of that, now... He has to pay this person $500,000 in punitive damages. And believe me, I have got my lawyer working overtime when it comes to this. Because if I can take punitive damages out of your ass, I'm going to do it. All right? So all you trolls out there, you better be well warned that, uh, you know, sending, pe sending a pizza to somebody's house, uh, you know, you could get $500,000 out of their ass. I'm not joking around. I'm not joking around, man. Anyway, just a warning to all those trolls out there. 
All right, five hundred thousand dollars because he sent him a pizza. I'm not joking around. And that that could be fucking you. All right, that could be fucking you. Anyway, I, we were, I don't even know where I was at after all those fucking W W W W <laughs> Mexican outside your house. You bitch mate, you ain't gonna do shit about my music. Quit fucking yelling, you bitch ass. That's not how the Mexicans talk out here, bro. All right, maybe they talk out th that way in Califas, but that's not how they talk out here. Have you ever seen Mexicans in San Antonio? They got the tattoo of the fucking skyline on their face. I mean, I'm not fucking joking around. These guys are fucking serious criminals out here. All right. I mean, these guys will fucking slice your throat for looking at their chick twice. I mean, I'm not even fucking joking around. These guys fucking take penitentiary chances for questioning their machismo. <laughs> I'd buy that. And what the hell is this dollar. daily TTS Spurg session? J J J J J J J J J J J J J J J J J J J J J J J J J J J J J J J J J J J J J J J J J J J J J J J J J J J J J J J J J J J J J J Ghost when Trump becomes the nominee. I know I said a few things about Trump, but he's the nominee now, so I'm warming no, up him no, again or something no, like no, that. Then you no. rage whenever we no. bring up your anti-Trump comments. Sad, just sad, ghost. No, high council, that's not going to happen. All right, I will abstain from the goddamn election if Trump is the nominee. All right, I will abstain from the election, just like I, I abstained from the fucking 2008 election when dumbass liberal John McCain was the damn nominee, and he put Sarah Eskimo Bimbo Palin as his vice presidential running mate. All right, so I don't know what the hell you're talking about. Anyway, oh, Jesus Christ. Can you all just give me a break, man? Seriously. You get to Radio Gruff ET already. Shut up! Jesus Christ, man. All right, uh, look, let's try to get back to the show. I'm going to try to get back to the show, all right? Even though I've wasted time here with a bunch of W's, all right, I'm going to try to get back to this show. Now, the last thing I talked about was this, all right, that Jared Kushner is cooperating with Jack Smith, all right? Uh, and Trump is very upset about it, as he should, all right? This is why... This is why I want Christie. This is why I want Christie in the debates. This is why I want Trump in the debates, so that Christie can make him look lower than a leprechaun's nutsack. All right. You abstaining from voting is un-American. You hate this country if you don't vote. You're spitting on the memories of those who fought for your right to vote. What a commie. No, uh, I'm not going to abstain from the entire election. I'm still going to participate in the election cycle. I will just leave the president blank. All right, urinator, you fucking idiot. Anyway, as I was stating, here is the exchange from 2016 GOP debate between Little Marco and Chris Christie. And after this small exchange, you will understand why I want... Not only to back up Christie, but I know he can win, and he can make all these people in debates look like idiots. And uh, Jimmy Powell says, "Have you ever smoked the str the strain Jared Kush nerds? Never heard of it. Uh, no, I have not. Here it is. Take a listen, and you'll see why Christie should be the candidate for 2024." We'll say if politics becomes and the presidency becomes about electing the people who have been in Congress or in the Senate the longest, we should all rally around Joe Biden. What? He's been around a thousand years. What? He's passed hundreds of bills, and I don't think any of us believe Joe Biden should be president. God of the damn it, fucking Gunter, you fucking stupid loser. If I remember loser. correctly, you mentioned voting red down the ticket dot. Even if you didn't like Trump, then at least vote for the political spectacle dot. What happened to that? That was in 2016, Gunter. All right. That was in 16 and uh, 18 when Trump lost it and dropped the ball and we lost the majority of the Senate and the House. All right. So anyway, play this again. Listen. The United States. And let's dispel once and for all with this fiction that Barack Obama doesn't know what he's doing. He knows exactly what he's doing. Barack Obama is undertaking a systematic effort to change this country, to make America more like the rest of the world. Oh, Jesus Christ. Can you all fucking stop you around? You only like Chris Christie because you guys both wear the same size look, adult diapers. Look, I am not joking around. If y'all don't fucking stop with these fucking shitbag, racist, insulting, perverted donations, I'm just going to get the fuck out of here, and y'all can play with your own pricks, okay? 
You people can play with your own pricks. I'm not going to sit here and continue to take this shit from you. This is goddamn Baller Friday, okay? This is Baller Friday, and I'm not letting you fucking idiots ruin it for me, okay? We're going to go back to the beginning. Shut the fuck up and listen! Anyway, troll in the interweb say, hurry up and talk about Christie's barrel ass. Well, just fucking, just listen here for a second, all right? We'll say if politics becomes and the presidency becomes Jesus about electing Christ. the people who have been in Congress or in the Senate the longest, when I'm president of the United States, we are going to re-embrace all the things that made America the greatest nation in the world, and we are going to leave our children what they deserve. <laughs> oh, oh interrupting pay pig? What the fuck? Coin, 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 coin. Shut up, man. God damn it. Hey, look, we got B jogging here. Uh, do radio graffiti or I'll call you a slur. Now, slur on these nuts. How about that, fucking B jogging? <laughs> I'd buy that. Oh, for a Jesus. No. no. Fuck you. You know, fuck you. And uh, Santa said, my chat was asking if you'd let Pippa into the Thunderdome. <laughs> no. How about no, Santa? <laughs> Holy fuck, this is boring. Get to RG Tubs. Hey, if it's boring, get the fuck out of here right the fuck right now. If it's boring, you fucking piece of shit, all right? And saying I'm not letting Pip into the Thunderdome. Are you fucking kidding me? Are, are you nuts? Are you high? Are you getting high in your own supply? <laughs> I'd buy that for a oh, dollar. Oh, Jesus, Gunter. Get that out of here. Yeah, yeah, that's right, Gunter. Look, stop texting. Jesus fucking Christ. Hey, look at Zamboni. Save big at Menards. <laughs> I'd buy that for a dollar. So in a threesome, how does the positions go? Ghost sucking off Chris High while West Coast capitalist is eating out ghosts' oh, ass. Oh, Jesus Christ. <sighs> anyway, we got propane, man. Hey, Ghost, I'm out with the family at Knott's Berry Farms. Uh, just wanted to wish you a good show and a happy Baller Friday. Well, thank you, propane man. I mean, I'm glad that you're out with the fam and are not sitting here listening and being subjected to this troll terrorism. I can tell you that right goddamn now. Hey, look at Monkey's Uncle for the Pippa IC Fund. Man, don't even kid around about that, Monkey's Uncle. Come on, man. Don't even kid around about that shit. You're going to get Winston Fujimori's asshole puckering. All right? So don't even, don't even go there. All right? Anyway, let's go ahead and listen to the response by Christie in the 2016 GOP debates in reference to little Marco Rubio. The single greatest nation in the history of the world. Senator Rubio, thank you. I do want to ask Governor Christie. That we, uh, you know, we're in a major problem with, uh, uh, major. hold on, who the fuck did that so I could kick them the fuck out? Who the fuck did that, dude? Who the fuck, who the fuck did that? I'm not even kidding around. Who the fuck did that shit? Who the fuck did that? Fucking... Uh, all right. Uh, dude. Uh, I'm telling you, man. I, I'm, I'm telling you. You know, I kick... Uh, I'm, I'm muting whoever the fuck... Oh, Jesus buy Christ. That for a dollar. Stop pausing the video and let us watch it. For fuck's sakes, you bitch. All right, dude. I'm, I'm done. I'm done with this fucking show. I've got so much shit to talk about, but you people have ruined my Baller Friday, and I refuse to fucking sit here and continue to take this garbage. I'm not even kidding around. I'm not even fucking kidding around. And uh, let's see. We got some super chat here. Uh, it's got uh, Santa. It's called core messaging. That's why he repeats it. Well, it sounds more like robotic, disgusting sentence fragment fucking spitting is what it sounds like. And Frank Zappa, I'm from Jersey, and those down, now nine downgrades through both administrations, previous two Dems administrations kept it. Uh, Murphy Dem has brought our credit back. Rubio is right. Well, you know, it's the Democrats that ran the state, bruh. I mean, they still run the state. Uh, Menno Ray, watch a tax hike happen for a bigger White House pantry budget. Okay, great. And uh, Jimmy Powell, you don't use grinder, right? Uh, all right, dude. All right, I'm getting the fuck out of here. All right. Uh, but before I do, I do want to say that uh, Chris Christie, because Donald Trump tries to go low on Chris Christie, uh, and he was asked by this, uh, asked this question by Pierce Morgan. Take a look at this. I'd kick his ass. Chris Christie brags about beating Trump in a possible UFC fight. 
and Biden will have a seizure or some shit. <laughs> I'd buy that for a dollar. What is it? Your power top is waiting for you. Bring a straw to felt your own a hole. Oh, Jesus Christ. Uh, dude, I can't do this anymore, man. This has been a hor horrible show. <laughs> I'd buy that for This a is a dollar. horrible show today. I can't wait until the debate in August when Vivek Ramaswamy eviscerates that bulbous hawk. Oh, okay, Christy yeah, sure. Christy couldn't navigate a treadmill. Oh, yeah, sure. Vivek will expose him as a stupid, frothing at the mouth neocon who will declare war on Iran day one if elected. Uh, so Vivek what? 24. So what? Iran needs to be put out of its misery as far as I'm concerned. All right, and Santa with a super chat. Good show, buddy. Hope to see you on the ghost show this Sunday. Oh, yeah, you think I'm going to do a goddamn ghost show after this shit? Are you fucking nuts? Anyway, Frank Zappa with a super chat. Our current state Senate majority leader is an anti-Trump Republican elected by Dems. Well, there you go, man. Fucking Jersey. Uh, the only thing good about Jersey is pizza. That's about it. And the Sopranos. The Sopranos kicked ass. All right, the Jersey mob over there. All right. Hey, I'm from Jersey over here, right? What are you talking about here, right? Hickory dickory dock, your mom was stuck in my cock, all right? The clock struck two, I dropped my goo, I dumped the bitch on the next block, all right? Oh! I'm, I'm joking. That, that's not how Jersey people are, all right? I mean, give me a break. We got a lot of anime lovers in Jersey as well, all right? Anyway, uh, Zamboni driver, throw that ass in the octagon. And we got Urinator, who's been a member for eight months, who said, uh, Chris Christie can't go more than two sentences without getting winded. The only thing he can destroy is a blooming onion from Outback. Can't wait to see you back on the Trump train in 24. Ain't gonna happen, baby. All right. Uh, be jogging. If I buy a spot in the Thunderdome, does the chat room use an app? Yes, it uses the Element app on the Matrix. Uh, yeah, it's that. Also, how long will it take for me to get an invitation? I don't want to wait. Uh, just give me, like, fucking 30 minutes after the show. I'd buy that for a Christy's dollar. gunt. I wonder what my penis looks like. I know it's not size. Oh, gee. Yeah, give me 30 minutes after the show ends, okay? Be jogging. And Santa with a sad face. Oh, Jesus Christ. Anyway, once again, Chris Christie says he would kick Trump's ass, whether in a UFC octagon or a debating stage. And that's why Trump doesn't want to attend the GOP debates. Wow, man, what a baller Friday. Right, first, I get bombarded by a bunch of troll terrorists and cyber vermin. They got a troll hooking it up with a basic membership over there, Flamenco. Uh, anyway, we got some uh, buy me a coffees as well. Let me go ahead and take a look at those. We got uh, Froppy. Uh, who is fatter, Chris Christie? Or I already said that. Oh, look, B. Joggin hooked it up with 15 beers. Uh, yeah, I'll give you your... Uh, now, uh, anybody who does the 15 beers on Buy Me a Coffee to get an entrance into the Thunderdome, I will message you via Buy Me a Coffee. So you'll get the message via your email, but the message will be on Buy Me a Coffee so that, you know, you have that... If you want to remain anonymous, you know, kind of thing. You know what I'm saying? So just FYI. And uh, we've got uh, more people. We got a Hal 9000 Ooze. I thought Zelensky was a comedian. He was. He was a comedian. Um, Ghost Omajima, Dice Clay can't even take a joke without wanting to fight you. And you think he's a comedian? Also, got my phone primed and ready for radio graffiti. <laughs> oh, my God. Can y'all just give me a break with the radio graffiti stuff, man? Anyway, once again, uh, Zelensky leaving NATO empty-handed, being told, hey, we're not Amazon. you got to figure this shit out for yourself. So that's why I'm saying uh, this is a clear message by Biden to Putin to say that, look, it's the ball's in your court. We could end the war tomorrow. <laughs> I'd buy it's that it's in your dollar. court, Putin, all right? I'm done. I'm done with this show. Oh, no, Jesus you're not Christ. done with this show, and you only say that and that you're depressed for brownie points. Get out of <laughs> Ah, you fucking idiot! <sighs> anyway, for those that didn't hear it, obviously, uh, The Hill didn't really... They didn't really uh, manage the audio on that one very well. And the United States ain't going to just take that, like, you know, lying down. And look, that's not the only thing going on in Sudan. Sudan is really, you know, just going to hell. It really is going to hell. Take a look at this. Put the PC shot on. Army shelling of a market kills dozens as Sudan violence continues to escalate. 
Now, obviously, this wasn't CIA ADA. This was either the paramilitary or the military. <laughs> I'd you know? buy that for a dollar. To my audience, this is a self dono by ghost. Oh, I can't come Christ. out and say it, but this allows me the plausible deniability to give this message. I ghostler. Personally endorse the National Justice no, Party, and I'm a huge fool. fan of Warren Balog and Mike Painovich. That's a that's I don't know what the hell that's supposed to mean. I, I, that's a bunch of crap. All right, all right. But anyway, as I was stating, all right, lots of bad shit happening in Sudan, and it's either going to be from Yemen, Sudan, or Yemen and Sudan. All right. <laughs> I'd buy oh, that Jesus for a Christ. Dollar. Oh, what the hell? Oh, God, what the hell? Jesus Christ, that sounds like fucking Zelensky getting a rim job in, in a spider hole. I mean, Jesus Christ. Anyway, as I was stating, five government soldiers injured in clashes with Al Qaeda in Yemen. All right. Be on the lookout for Yemen, man. But remember, the Houthis used to hit up Saudi Arabia from Yemen. So, yeah, it all, it all comes clear now, doesn't it? Why Saudi Arabia isn't no, the fucking largest oil producer. They're buying it from Russia! <laughs> I'd buy that Hold on, what the hell? Anonymous, what the hell is this? Hey there, buddy. I sure do love watching your show, especially on a baller Friday. Um, I don't really understand a lot of the geopolitical... Uh, rigmarole and all that. I try to listen when I can and pick up what I can, but uh, hell, you know how that is, but I really don't get any of this damn Al Chappers shit and all that, them over there in the UK or whatever the hell it is they do. I don't know, drink tea or something like that, but hell, they need to go ahead and settle on down, have themselves a nice Friday night. And, hell, I noticed there were a few less people in here. I sure hope they're out having themselves some summer fun and not sitting behind the goddamn fucking keyboard wow well i have somebody making their uh two cents known there a little, little southern man right there anyway thank you very much for your insights there all right so anyway uh, this is a very interesting situation Hold, putin's vibrator <laughs> what the hell <laughs> oh jesus all right I, I think that's enough all right I think that's enough. I think I've covered everything here, all right? You guys have made this show a horrible fucking show. Uh, let's go to the totally useless news section, all right? How about that? It is now time for totally useless news. And uh, by the way, this isn't really useless, but I think it's interesting. Take a look at this. FDA says soda sweetener aspartame is safe. All right, and somebody said that's just hair. <laughs> That's just hair. <laughs> Damn. <laughs> Excuse me. That that fucking hit hit me right in the boo boo there, man. All right. Uh, let me go ahead. Oh shit! I'd buy that for a dollar. Oh. Oh Jesus Christ! Why are y'all doing this crap? Jesus Christ. What is your problem? Stop yelling, you spurg idiot. Don't call me a spurg idiot, you stupid son of a bitch! I look, all these fucking people are out here trying to fucking tell. I want radio graffiti, girls. I want radio graffiti. And what is this? Uh, Jimmy Powell says, D you don't get off until you cough. <laughs> okay, thank you, Jimmy Powell. I appreciate that shit, all right? I appreciate that shit. Hey, hold on just a second. I think somebody fucking just texted me, for Christ's sake. Oh, gee, it's a fucking... Dude, these stupid alerts on these, you know, poor... Uh, look, I don't ever hear on these Amber Alerts or whatever the fuck they are, I don't ever see anybody that's truly kidnapped. It's usually fucking some domestic situation where the goddamn fucking woman takes the goddamn kid away from the father or some shit. And look, enemy capitalist, get to Radio Graffiti. We're the boss of you. Nobody's the fucking boss of me, you asshole, all right? Nobody is the boss of Ghost. I am the boss of me, all right? You fucking people ain't the boss of me. <sighs> Jesus Christ. All right, folks, hold on. Let me take one more smoke and let me think. Hold on. Don't make demands of me in the chat. I'm going to think about it. 
Now look at these people. We own you. Look at these. Look at these fucking people, dude. Look at these fucking people. We own you. We're your boss. You know what I'm saying? Jesus fucking Christ. Give me a smoke. I'll tell you what. I will do it if somebody donates just one donation saying something nice. That That's all I want. Saying something nice to old ghost. I don't care if it's a... Uh, look at this. Look at this shit. Only a low IQ moron would think Chris Christie would win the nomination. Trump is polling so well. You are nothing but a turncoat. What you see now? You see, I'm supposed to do fucking radio graffiti when I got shit like this being donated for fuck's sake, man. I gotta resort to hitting the goddamn positive reinforcement button to get anything positive. Yeah, I know that. Let me have one more. One more positive reinforcement button. Yeah, you're goddamn right, man. Suck it! Suck it, man! We've got, uh, oh, look at Ghost Omajima. Something nice. Yeah, thanks a lot. And look at Jimmy Powell. I love you. That's great. And look, look, at, look at John Smitty. Suck it. Hey, hey, John Smitty, take a whiff of this. Uh, uh, uh. All right, I like that. Nasty chicken grease, corn oil, and cream beef, bitch. We got Jag the Lux Ray. I'll give you some positivity if you do radio graffiti. Cheers. And be jogging. You're not very fat. There, get to radio. I'm not very fat. I'm not fat. All right. I'm a decent looking guy, if I don't say so myself. All right. <laughs> I'd buy that for a dollar. I prefer you over the losers on the radio. Hey, you're entertaining. Uh, well, there. Look, look. Of all people, of all people, Froppy had to give me a decent compliment. All right. And we got Bash. Look at that. Thank you for another good show, Ghost. We appreciate it. All right. All right, I'll go ahead and do it, all right? I'm only going to do it for a little bit, all right? All right, so let's go ahead and get to everybody's favorite part of the broadcast. And I'm talking about Radio Graffiti! That's right, folks, Radio Graffiti, the part of the broadcast where the spectators become a part of the spectacle. All you got to do is give me a call right now. <laughs> I'd buy that for a Butt dollar. crack. I want to sniff your ass crack. I love you so much. Oh, Jesus Christ. Well, you're lucky somebody actually sent me a decent fucking, you know. Hold on. <laughs> what, High Council, you fucking piece dollar. of shit? Here is something nice. I think you're the least bad out of the conspiracy theorists on the internet. I'm not a fucking conspiracy theorist, you fucking piece of shit. And Jack and Off said, I look forward to your show every day. Well, thank you, Jack and Off. I appreciate it. And we got Santa. Good show tonight, Ghost. I have some positivity to share on Radio Graffiti. Trust me, all right? Anyway, if you want to participate in Radio Graffiti, all you got to do is give me a call at that number at the top right there. 667-770-1015, okay? And once the bitch starts talking, push in 844-286, and you will be in queue to be a part of Radio Graffiti. And when I call on your area code or on your name, you've got exactly four to five seconds to say... Whatever it is that's on your mind, that's why we call this Radio Graffiti. And it's been one hell of a fucked up baller Friday, I'll tell you that right goddamn now. And we got McLovin2169. Yo, Ghost, have you ever looked into running or biking as a hobby? No. No, absolutely not. Not only would it be good for your health, it would help you meet new people and nature. I, I go outside and barbecue. All right? I see enough nature doing that, all right? When I'm going outside and doing some barbecuing, that's that's my uh, nature walk right there. I don't need to be fucking going walking and doing bike riding. I'm a fucking old man. I flip over the fucking handlebars and split my fucking head open, for Christ's sake. Get the fuck out of here. I ain't fucking biking. And by the way, uh, nobody respects bikes on the road anyway. I mean, it's almost like if, if, if fucking driver sees you biking on the road, it's like fucking video game. They fucking like Mario Kart your ass. Are you fucking kidding me? I, dude, I'm, I swear to God, at least every other day I hear some fucking person getting hit while riding a bike. I, I'm not fucking kidding, man. Anyway, once again, call up 667-770-1015. And then once the bitch starts talking, go ahead and push in the code 844-286. And you will be in queue to be a part of Radio Graffiti. All right? And when I call on your area code or on your name, you've got four to five seconds to say... Whatever it is that's on your mind, that's why we call this Radio Graffiti. And, uh, Engineer, do we got any Radio Graffiti callers on the line, man? Man, man, man. 
All right. Well, without any further ado, let's go ahead and get to Radio Graffiti right now. All right. Let's go ahead and connect to the Radio Graffiti line. What you're about to hear is troll hell. So viewer discretion is advised. All right. There are 27 participants in the conference. All right. Shut up! Jesus Christ. Did y'all hear that? That's that's the radio graffiti line. All lines open. All right. That's that's what you get right there. All right. That gives you a little bit of an idea of the type of person that's listening to this broadcast right now, folks. Okay. All right. Let's go ahead and take a couple of numbers here. All right. And uh, I, I guess we're going to have to call on fucking high council. High council radio graffiti. Okay, Ghost. So, I, like I said, you're not going to win the golden microphone. You keep saying you're going to win it, but you never have. Also, you keep saying conspiracy theories that are blatant misinformation that are absolutely lies, and you keep contradicting yourself. I mean, in 2020, you kept saying COVID was a Chinese plot. Now you're saying it's fake, and now you're, you betray Trump as well. So. All right. Well, you thanks. are more enjoyable Thank you. in the TD and IC than here on TGS or TCR. Thanks for being a reasonable person when you are not under pressure. Oh, well, thank you. Look at Haywood giving me some props over here, right? He's in the Thunderdome. He was in the IC, but somebody donated him out. They were like, I want this fucker out of here. I'll give you 250 cash right now. Goes to kick him the fuck out of here. Right the fuck right now. So anyway, sorry there, Haywood. All right, uh, well, let's go ahead. We got uh, 780 Radio Graffiti. Hey, Ghost, I uh, just wanted to apologize for last time I called in. I was a little crass and crude, you know, just just doing it for the lulls, but, uh, you know. All right, man, well, but, um, do you, you want to give a shout-out? Do you want to say something? Um, shout-out to Brandon, my homie Brandon. He's pretty cool. Discord Mafia, gang gang. Uh, been a long-time fan of yours, man, since, like, fucking, I don't know, 2011, back when your shit was posted on B. When that was bumping back in the day, you know. So, oh, so you're, I don't know. you're a B. To give you my props, you're man. a B tard. Well, fuck, not anymore. I've grown up. I'm not a little kid, but back in the day, certainly, you know. All right. Well, hey, man, that's how all these trolls found me. Believe it or not. All right. The section of 4chan called B raided my fucking goddamn show in 2009 and never fucking left. All right, so if you're asking yourself, if you're a first-time listener, and you're saying, what the fuck is going on here? That's why, right there, okay? And after B raided me, that's when 4chan was like, look, uh, we're going to make poll because of Ghost, all right? All right, Ghost made everybody on 4chan a little political, so now we're going to fucking make poll in honor of Ghost. So I got I to gotta give props. I mean, I, I, I had a lot of impact in Internet history. I'll tell you that right damn now. All right, let's take some more uh, numbers here. Uh, how about, uh, I think this should be Fruitcake Texan, Radio Graffiti. Hey, Ghost, happy Fruitcake Friday. It's your buddy Fruitcake Texan. What's up, man? Hey, I, I gave it some thought, and I'm actually okay with Al Chapper's rejoining the Thunderdome. Uh, I decided I was going to go ahead and capitalize. I'm taking bets on who's going to tart out harder, West Coast or Al Chapper's. Uh, three to one odds in favor of West Coast, and I'll be taking bets at my Bitcoin address. So uh, I'll go ahead and post that in the Thunderdome chat for y'all uh, if you want to take bets. And you can definitely trust me with your money. Oh yeah, that you sound like a guy that you can trust, right? I mean, I'm sure people can trust you, bareback as well, right? Uh, I'm clean. Don't worry about. It. I'm completely clean, all right? I only have herpes simplex ten. Uh, how about three oh eight radio graffiti? Hey, what up, Ghost? What? Defeat your hootie, man. Hey, what's up? Defeat your hootie. How you been, man? Nah, I'm all right. It's been a long time. Uh, I had a real serious question. It's political. Go ahead, man. So, like, when you get a check, is it like the publisher's clearinghouse size from Israel or what? When I get a check, what? Like, do you get a check from publisher's clearinghouse from Israel or, or what? <laughs> Fuck off, dude. All right. Look, all right, 
I don't know why you people suggest that I'm being paid by somebody or something nefarious is happening and that I'm some kind of a fucking agent or something. That is absolutely not the case. All right, that is absolutely not the case. So don't even go there, all right? I use yarmulkes for coffee filters, all right? Uh, How about 317, Radio Graffiti? I want to tell y'all that ghost happens to have a whole bunch of friends that happen to be man, Nick, crap, four-legged French frog. You have a whole bunch of friends. I do. I happen to have a whole bunch of friends that happen to be muck shovel and mix and limeys and frogs and kangaroo bangers and you name it, man. I happen to have all. I'm a melting pot of friendship, man. Uh, how about uh, six one zero radio graffiti? I'm on the air. Yeah. Fuck. Okay, great. That, that's all. That, you just wanted to fuck? Is that it? Who doesn't? Uh, how about 872, Radio Graffiti? Gurman, the sign on your ass says, Entry. Thank you for you, ghost. This 15-inch sausage fits in your ass. This is too good. I'm gonna... Oh. Oh. Oh, I'm coming! Oh, I'm coming! <sighs> Sometimes a gear frog has to bottom. Hmm. You sick fucking asshole. God damn son of a bitch! God damn it! Get the shit out of here! Damn it! The shit out of here! Damn it! <sighs> I knew it, dude. You see? I I thought I was going to get some... I don't know. I don't know. Hold on. We got... uh, I think... uh, What is this? Uh, Jag the Luxray wants me to call on him. Jag the Luxray. You're on the air. Radio Graffiti. Hey, girls. This is Jag the Luxray. How you doing, man? How you doing, man? I I hope you're feeling better. Yeah, I'm starting to get better. I'm on the mend right now. My voice is still a bit raspy from being sick and whatnot. Yeah... I don't know what's going on with these trolls and stuff. They're being a bit, being a bit much of malarkey, and then I can't really understand it. I can't understand how you feel, dude. It's, it's horrible. It's horrible. Just imagine doing something that you want to like doing, like a fucking podcast or a broadcast, and having to put up with this kind of crap. I understand, man. It's it's, it's kind of ridiculous. I, I know what it's like to be bullied and and, and besmirched and humiliated, but and I understand that well because. I was even talking with, with, with West Coast Capitalists in the Thunderdome while after Froppy interrupted your show, and I kind of understand how he feels as well. So shout to WCC, shout to you, shout to the engineer, and happy, happy Ball Friday, man. Hey, man, cheers to you, Jag Deluxe Ray, and happy Baller Friday to yourself, man, all right? Good to talk to you, good to hear from you, all right? All right, we've got uh, MK Ultra Meme, Radio Graffiti. You, the final interview in process. Uh, according to reports, it comes down to three candidates, potential candidates for vice president, Newt Gingrich, Mike Pence, and Chris Christie. Take that now, shit off! Like Chris Christie. Take wrong, that shit he's, up. He's kind of a fat barrel ass with an attitude. But I, the only thing I don't like about him is this Bridgegate situation in which uh, it could be a thorn in the side of the campaign of Trump. Get the fucking God damn it! All right, you fucking scumbags! All right, dude. Let me tell you something, man. I'm, I'm you see, I'm losing my voice now. You see, I'm on. Ah! Damn it! God damn it! God damn it! You son of a bitch! All right, man. I'm telling you right now, man. If I if if y'all do some fucking splicing or some fucking AI shit like that, I'm gonna fucking get the fuck out of here. And who the hell is this? New ghost commercial, radio graffiti. You save big money. You save big money. When you shop Menards. Oh Jesus Christ! Welcome to Menards, motherfucker. What? I've had it with you. At this point, hey! I'm supposed to tell you about our great fucking deals. 
our fucking amazing prices. What about half off this five-piece outdoor dining set? Only six nine nine. I'm supposed to let you sniveling little shits know about that deal. What about half off all lawn care products, including weed whackers and push lawn mowers? Yeah, I bet you f***ers would like that. Saving big money so you can spend it at the bathhouse? Yeah, I fucking bet. What about this? You suck my fat fucking... No, God! No! 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 Ah! Shit! Son of a bitch! Get the shit out of here! Get the shit out of here! All right, man, I've had just about enough, dude, all right? I've had enough! I try to give you all fucking radio graffiti, and this is the kind of shit you do, man. I would give you all genuine radio gra fucking graffiti, and this is what you fucking do, man. <sighs> fucking son of a bitch. And we got Felix Mateev hooking it up with a super chat, saying, Hello, Ghost, I finally caught you live. Have a great Friday, and cheers. <sighs> Oh, my God, dude. I, I'm sorry I'll have to hear that. Look, I'm going to take a couple more, and then I might get the fuck out of here. I can't I can't do this. And who the hell is Ghost's only female fan, Radio Graffiti? Hello, This is Jim Morton. The stress factory is sold out this mid no, weekend. No, no, no. That's it. That's fucking it. That's it. That's it. That's it. All right, I, I got to get the fuck out of here. You guys are going to get me kicked off of YouTube. Nah, pick up Santa. Where the fuck is Santa? All right? I've got nothing but a bunch of fucking shit-talking pieces of shit. We at True Capitalist Radio do not condone the racism that these pieces of trash are saying on this, on this fucking shit. We don't condone this, all right? We don't condone this. Jesus Christ, dude. Look, all right, I'll take a couple of more and that's it, all right? 509 Radio Graffiti. Hey, hey uh, so I was uh, just filling out this EBT application and I yeah, was you know, you know what? You sound like a fruity <laughs> ass. Get him out of here. Get him out. Hey, ghost. It's your old friend, Boot Chan. Boot Chan. Sorry, it looks like I came at a bad time. I just wanted to wish you a happy Baller Friday. My tranny ass is sipping on some Modelo and having a baller time. Oh, oh well, good. I mean, I'm glad that you're sipping on some, uh, you know, your libation, having a baller Friday. They, they, cheers to Boot Chan. All right, how about 702 Radio Graffiti? All right, well, first of all, we couldn't even hear you with your Obama phone. And secondly, it sounds like you got it up where the sun don't shine. Jesus fucking Christ. How about 267 Radio Graffiti? Oh, 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 hello, ghost. Hey, what's up, Santa? Oh, not much. Me and the elves were talking about that golden microphone there. Oh, uh, unfortunately, I can't help you with that, but uh, we, we, were, we were thinking. Uh, how would you like to be the first recipient of the official aluminium microphone? No, no, no. I deserve the golden microphone, man. I've had 15 years... I had a 15-year, and it's going on 16 coming up this, this year, 16 going on 16-year illustrious internet broadcasting career. And I think that deserves a golden microphone, Santa. <laughs> I mean, don't, don't you? You don't like the Savage or Alex Call Jones. Call on Froppy Plaza. Wait, don't compare me to Alex Jones, you fucking... What, what are you, why does everybody compare me to that ripoff? He's ripped me off! He's ripped me off! Oh, it must be the New Yorker accent. I'm not entirely sure. Uh, you know what? Even fucking Santa is shit-talking me at this fucking point in time, for heaven's sake. How about Froppy, Radio Graffiti? Hey, man, I don't know the, why people are being so disrespectful. You know, I'm trying to give you positivity, and, you know, you do all the, you do these shows all the time, and uh, you, you, know, you don't get any respect for it. Um, you know, I, I, could, I could give you a blowjob. Uh, well, I don't want that kind of positivity, all right? I mean, you're going to give me positivity in more ways than one if you do something like that, all right? I mean, I'm going to I'm gonna test positive on my HIV test if you even fucking touch me. I'm just saying. Hey, hold on. Ghost's positivity speech, Radio Graffiti. Ghost's positivity speech, Radio fucking Graffiti. 
hat in and radio fucking graffiti. Oh, no. Man, I wish I should be an alternative right now, folks. I should just join a group or something new compared to my inner circle group to enlighten these folks out there in this city relating to the event happened in Dobson, as far as my knowledge, of course. I mean, I should be getting a fucking wizard robe to rally those who are in the group to act as What the hell? Dignity for these white folks, all right? So... I might, uh, I'm going to give it a roll here in a moment on how to become 100% white. All right, so it is what it is. Good morning, San Antonio. We are. We hate. We hate. No! No! We hate. God, God damn it, man! God damn it! Fuck shit! Look! Enough of the fucking racism, man! Enough! Jesus Christ, man. And who the hell is masturbating hippo, Radio Graffiti? Masturbating hippo, Radio fucking Graffiti, you fucking idiot. Oh, great. A Helen Keller deaf mute. That's fucking great. All right. How about Pippa Catches Ghost, Radio Graffiti? Oh, how bad dragon, Radio Graffiti? Come on, Dave Madsen. You don't have to hide your boner. Take these fucking pair of pants off. Uh, take it off, take it off. Fine, I'll take that pair of pants off. Oh, I'm cooming. Oh, I'm cooming. Ghost, what the fuck? Pippa, I can explain. I didn't know you were home after doing the one thing I can't do. Show up on time for a stream and do it for nine hours. For fuck's sake, Ghost, I was going to tell you I had to cancel because someone at Menards was going to come and sponsor True Capitalist Radio and The Ghost Show. And I come in here and see you and this old fart in our bed. Come on, I didn't mean to piss you off, okay? I'm sorry. That's it, Ghost. I'm going to be showing you a marathon of some hentai and some Viva Piñata porn as punishment. And then I'm going to have you kick Dave the fuck out or I'll tell Mark about your weed smoking on stream again. Come on, Pippa. Stop treating me like how I treat the engineer. You mean like this? How bad dragon? Dude, I'm, I'm fucking... Get this shit out of here, for fuck's sake. Get this fucking shit out of here! Get it off! Get it off! God damn it, get it out of here! I'm done, dude. I am so done, dude. Get this shit out. I'm done, dude. Y'all ruined my baller Friday. My voice is Goodbye. fucked. Goodbye! 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 Good fucking bye! Jesus Christ, I can't believe this fucking Baller Friday show turned out like this. I can't believe it. And we got Jimmy Powell with a fucking masturbating hippo fucking emoji. And we got feminist socialists going 16. And you let Nick Fuentes be on top? What the fuck does that mean? <laughs> I'd buy and, that and in Philly. Why do you always forget to mention that you were AWOL from 2012 to 2015? Also, when is the underdog going to host the show? <laughs> shut up. All right, Ann and Philly, shut up. And we got Ghost Omajima pick up. Dude, I, I, fuck all of you people, man. You all fucked up my goddamn Baller Friday. All right? You all fucked up my goddamn Baller Friday, and you expect shit out of me. You're demanding shit out of me. You expect shit out of me. Fuck you. Fuck you. Fuck you. Fuck you.